hello, hello. Welcome back to Sunless Sea. Oh, man, it's, uh, it's this is a new recording session. It's been a few days, and I'm excited to play a bit more of this game. Um, so something I'm going to be doing with this and a lot of other series now is I'm going to do shorter streams more frequently so that I don't have these long breaks where I'm like, what was I doing again? What's happening? Where am I? Uh, so... Sorry for the Twitch people for the fact that streams will be shorter, or at the very least be switching up games more frequently. But it's to facilitate me taking less long of pauses from them. <laughs> Returning to London. The lights of London welcome you home. Uh, yeah, so we've been at sea for a while. The harbor master has a message for us. Okay, just some generic stuff. Uh, so let's see here, where was I? Yeah, we had just sailed down around like this. Uh, because I believe we were looking for Gators Morn. Oh no, we'd sailed out and down and around. And yeah, and we're delivering a guy who I suspect is investigating murders, but might also be committing them. Uh, alright. Yeah, our father, his bones are somewhere way out east, if I recall correctly, we had found out. So let's just start going through some, let's quickly look at our journal, just to refresh myself. And for those who are watching this on YouTube, this might be a good refresher for some of you, because, you know, it's a once a week thing. Uh, yeah, the Rose Market, blah blah blah. Our favors are looking good. Uh, we've learned that her father's on the Mushroom Island, but I want to talk with her more before we tell her. <laughs> he wants to go to the Chapel Vites in the north. Uh... We've lost one captain. Hmm. Others will change. Captains have died. These things happen. Others will change the enter Z. Cool. Now, our father's bones. Um. We have. We learned where they are. Uh, the scholar suggests you seek answers for in Irem for the puzzle box we found. The tomb call in a story played out. Uh. Oh, here we go. Father's Bones. Uh, Cold Trail. This, seek the King Gator Castle on the far southeast. Or in the far southeast. Um. Right, our travel, our travel writer wants to go to Khan's Heart. So, that's where we're gonna take him next. We've met the pirate pirate. Okay. Um. Uh, so, yeah, let's talk now with... Let's visit our friend, the, the Admiral. Uh, we, yeah, we got the strategic information he wanted us to get. That's satisfactory. Eminently satisfactory. We've read that stuff before. Um, let's submit all of our other port reports for some pay and fuel and all of that. The canal. Salt Lions. Quaker's Haven. Dalemex. Uh, is there anything in particular they want to see? Uh... Oh! Is there anything you need, Admiral? Oh no, okay, we have asked him that in previous playthroughs, I just forgot. Alright, um, anything in particular you need? He wants me to go to Frostfound in the north. Okay. So it looks like we're heading north today, because we're... I think our main pro focus for now is going to be following where the Admiral points us, because that's just a good way to reach out and get some early quest stuff. Oh, you can ask him to not send you to Frostfound. That's hilarious. <laughs> but yeah, now we're going to head to Frostfound for him, uh, which is located somewhere in the north, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Uh, I want to ask him for a favor... We're gonna get some cheap repairs at Heritage Shipyard. Yeah, Admiralty Shipyard, because that's cheaper than the others and it tends to give a good repair. Get completely repair the hull. Well, hang on, let's compare it real fast. Complete your repair for one hundred, for seventy-five. If you're badly damaged and short on money, this will go. 
Not call no more than 74. Yeah, okay, so that is without a doubt the cheapest option. And it only costs us a couple favors. Alright, uh, he gave us a bunch of fuel. How does that look once we... Okay, we're at 5 and 11. Um... Ooh, do we want to get a tattoo? I don't think the terror is high enough for justifying that. So let's... Ah, uh, here we go. Let's deliver our Sphinx Stone load we picked up. And look at that. 500 echoes. Sign, he... Sign, sign. Here's a receipt. Here's my... It dis... Uh, Discretion contract. Here's a pe the penalty contract. Your vision is blurred by the end of it all. The cart rumbles off into the co coiling fog. Here's your reward. Nice. Um, hang on. Let's go to our home real fast. Uh, and I want to. Where is it? Visit my study. Is that where I go to read the newspaper? Hang on. That's what I'm looking for. Because the newspaper sometimes has very helpful things. Am I crazy? Why is that optional? Oh, there is no news for me because I don't have the lantern. You would have the gas lamp down here if that was an option. All right. Um. Ooh, the merchant venture. We met him with our last guy, but his quest generates new things every time. He wants either approved or unapproved romantic literature or so. Oh, no. Okay. It's the same as it used to be. Maybe it isn't different every time. And that's a mis uh, me misremembering things. Uh, I don't think I have. Oh, let's give him our extraordinary implications. Yeah, look at that. 225 echoes. Nice, nice, nice. We are doing very good. Um, new recruit looking to get on board. We have a first officer, which we, we need chief engineer or gunnery officer. Cause we already have a first officer. This person would be a engineer, which we need. All right. So yeah, let's get the maybe's daughter. At the end of the rotting dock, a woman perches on a suitcase. Both she and the suitcase are noticeably cleaner than everything else in view. Hello, where are you headed? Uh, on second thought, I don't mind. Can I come aboard? Yes, I'm an engineer. But I am, but I am an engineer in a hurry. Alright, yeah, let's hire her. Welcome aboard. If anyone comes looking for me, well, I'm not accepting callers. Can I trust you pass that on? You don't want them distracting me from my duties. All right, let us assign her and have a conversation with her. I can invite her to dine with me if I had a strange catch. And I can proposition her. Okay. Um. Let's go back into London. We could use some more crew, because we're not at full on that. Yeah, let's, let's hire some more crew. Look at that. I got three new crew. So, yep, nice and full, because I passed a good hearts challenge. And let's go for a break in the docks. Unlucky, so we just went and, you know, slept around a little bit, but nothing special. But we did gain some recent news, that's good. Our ship is fully repaired. Now let's go to shops. Ah, uh, hang on. What's our hold looking like? A okay. So let's buy up some more fuel. Get ourselves to eleven on that. You know we burn through that fast fuel faster than food. So let's get up to sixteen on that. And now let's look at... Can I buy the next ship up? I don't think so. You know, I need 2,000 Echoes. I'm pretty close to getting the next ship up. Alternatively... Is there anything I would want from these guys? Hmm. 
I could just buy him all of the silk he needs. That'd make things very easy. Um... Let's hang on. To, let's sell the prisoners, honey. No point hanging on to things if I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Uh, I already have the best gun, and I don't have... I can get, I have auxiliary and bridge slots available, or I could get a better engine. Uh... Which section do they go on to? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Here we go, that's how you figure it out. I forgot. I, it's re-familiarizing myself a little bit. I can get some torpedo nets. Um... Cost torpedoes to use. Where is this assigned to? Forward weapon. We have ex I'm looking for auxiliary and bridge stuff. Right, hang on, let's look at... Who's the guy that sells the, all the crazy good stuff? This guy. Uh, this goes to forward. Yard average suppressor. Devours the engine emissions, ensuring that your engine never explodes at full power. Also slightly improves your chance of evading enemies' attention. Cool. Uh, I don't know where that gets attached, though. Aft. Okay. What I say I had? I have an auxiliary and a bridge, so I can't even get that. Auxiliary and a bridge, auxiliary and a bridge. Well. Okay, so this guy's super awesome engine costs would cost me five thousand cat five thousand coin, Jesus. Wrong beast of an engine. I could also just get this some light on engine upgrade if I wanted to. But we're not traveling far, so I think I might just sit on the money a little bit. Uh, if anything, I might just buy some more fuel. Just to make sure we're good on that. Because, hang on, let's look at the map and think about where we're going. So we're going to push far to the north, and then I might dip out a little further and hope to find something else. So. Yeah. Okay. Let's buy some more fuel. Make our, make sure we're nice and full on it. Um... I think we're good there. So, uh... Do I want to keep this one in? Mirrors and pages versus just hearts? Yeah, I think we're ready to set off now. Oh, hang on. We never take, took a look at... Well, first, the Rose Wharf. Yeah, nothing I really care about going on here. I re rarely care that much about the Rose Wharf. And... I can get a live specimen here if I wanted one for a reason. Let's set off. Alright. Look at that. We got a nice full crew. Now, so now we're just going to go explore the far north. Dun, dun. Oh, I adore this game. Oh, there's that beautiful soundtrack. So let's stop by the sisters. With any luck, we'll get there before the hunger ticks up too much and we'll be able to get our hunger emptied out. Come on. Come on. A little faster. Come on, I want to avoid eating food if I can. Oh, oh. There we go. Eating lunch with them will give us all the, the food. Oh, not receiving visitors. I'll trade my news for free food from them. Uh, let's have it with Phoebe. I never remember which one is what. Yeah, that empties out our food and gives us one an extra. Nice, nice. And now it's set off. Um, angle that way a little more. 
little bit more. All right, that should set me good. I'm gonna sip my coffee. Hmm. Come on, let's go pirate hunting a little bit. Easily worthwhile. One good hit is all we need, theoretically. What do we get? What do we get? Some mushroom wine. Nice. Always fun to hunt the pirates. Um. Yep, there's the edge of Vanderbright. Yeah, I I always try and prioritize getting the strongest gun because it makes combat less scary, and combat being less scary means you can get a lot of good stuff theoretically, and it's you can make a lot of money quickly because pirates, you know, it's like oh, 20, 30 ca uh, coins a uh, pop, you know, whatever they drop. Sometimes you'll just get some more supplies, which will save you on having to buy supplies later. It's always worthwhile to get a good gun in this game, I feel. Alright, um, let's visit that little restaurant we heard of. And I should be able to recruit... Yeah, when we don't have a cook... Oh no, we do have a cook. But we might as well recruit the guy now, so that we have a backup cook for later. Um... Will this reduce my hunger doing this? I mean, it's only 60 echoes. Ah, it does, that's very good. All right, that was worthwhile because that saves us on having to buy some food at another place. Uh, so let's... I don't want to do the last tour operation right now because that's going to take a lot of time. Let's gather some gossip. And let's give a little exploration of Vanderbright. The builders of this place worked with great slabs of neath wall stone, carved with blank eyed, unsmiling faces and blocky stoic serpents. Ah. Uh, I can picnic, costing me some supplies, or I'm gonna go and search warily. Succeed, yes! You can just about interpret these glyphs. They speak of a god who lives in the roof, a walking dream of storm, a memory of rage. The god of glyphs claims destruction of this temple. Alright, what do we... I think with that we're ready to move on. Because I don't think I want to buy anything here. I can sell the mushroom wine. I think it sells slightly better here than it does at home. Sure, why not? Empty empty out our hull a little. Alright, let's go north. Come on. Free food! Yum yum yum. Free food. All right, so now we're pushing further north. Because I'm right on the edge of a square, I'm pretty sure if I sort of wiggle back and forth a little, I should be able to uncover multiple. But I don't really know if I want to bother with that. Let's hang left a little bit more just to get the left more most ones, and then on another trip we can hang right slightly more. Yeah, that should clear up another one in a moment. Okay, yep, I'm in the right angle to be clearing them. I love this game. Sensor's Arch. Trying to be cautious of lifebergs, because even with the awesome gun I have, those things are a little scary. And I think we're good. 
Now, what was the place he asked me to visit again? It wasn't here, right? The Admiralty wants me to go to... Frostfound in the north. So... Not quite the place we were looking for. Um, but while we're here, let's gather some intelligence. Yeah, we've read this in our, with our previous captain, so I'm just going to click through. Explore the town. You fall into a revere as you wander the shore. There are words in the wind, a story of sorts, of the gates of the north. A pale light that began there, of a drowned light that will end there, of a high wilderness and that other, than, that other, sh that other ships may sail. You lift your eyes on the wall of salt of salt the the wall of salt work. Someone has scrawled. Is there a sea more sunless? I now have the attention of storm. Ooh. Okay, and I can try and reduce my terror with shore leave, but I think I'm good. Hmm. That's right, they trade in stories here. Ooh. I think I might be willing. Yeah, here. Give me, give me some more supplies. Trading stories for supplies feels like a good deal in my eyes, especially such an easy-to-copy type of story. <clears throat> Alright. Um, so, I don't think there's going to be another dock further north than this. So, I think if I want to find Frostfound, I have to sort of push east now. How much life does a lifeberg have? That's a lot. I would need to do so many hits, honestly. Alright, come on. Just push into Codex. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oh god, the lifebergs are terrifying. Okay, come on. I hate lifebergs. Okay, let's compile our port report here. And no interest in buying or selling, honestly. Okay. Okay. So, I guess we have to keep pushing east if we're going to find Frost Found. Oh, wow, we're at 20 minutes. So wherever we dock next is where we will end the episode. Let's see what we discover. Let's start sending our Z-Bat out, actually. Oh, Void's approach. Oh, shit. Chapel of Light. Yeah, it's gonna be right there. Okay. We got a similar layout to last time, it seems. At least for the north. Crew, nice, nice. All right. And I think we're gonna end this episode of Sunless Sea there. Man, I adore this game. Yeah, we'll interact with the chapel late and continue our exploration of the north next time. Hope you've all been enjoying this episode, and I'll see all you next week with more Sunless Sunday. Ta-ta!